Hello, welcome to T Classify. Today I'll be solving YX 2017 Chemistry Theory Question 3C. Sulfur 4 oxide is converted to tetrahydrocarbon 6 acid according to the following equation 2SO2, that's sulfur 6, 2 molar of sulfur 6, gas reacted with oxygen in liquid state, also reacted with 2 mole of water in liquid state, giving 2 mole of hydrogen tetrahydrocarbon to solvent 6 acid in aqueous form. If 1.5 moles of oxygen reacts with sulfur 4 oxide, calculate the mass of tetrahydrocarbon to solvent 6 axis produced. And we are just asked to calculate the mass of tetrahydrocarbon 6 acid produced. Then don't forget that the mass, the formula for calculating mass is that we are going to have number of moles is equal to mass of a molar mass. And by making the mass as the subject of the formula, we are going to have the number of moles times molar mass. So we have, let's say the solution, we are asked to calculate, let's to calculate the mass, mass of tetraoxosolvate 6 acid, that is H2SO4, produced. Produced. Then we should know that number of moles, number of moles is equals to mass over molar mass. Then to calculate mass, the mass is make as a subject of formula. Then we are going to have mass is equals to number of moles, number of moles multiplied by molar mass then with this we need number of mole we need number of mole before we can calculate the mass number of mole then it's unknown here then we need molar mass also is not is also not here molar mass then we calculate the molar mass of h2so4 molar mass of h2so4 is equals to we have one mole, two moles of hydrogen two atoms of hydrogen that is one multiplied by two plus one mole of oxygen that is there is one atom of oxygen present in hydrogen tetraoxo solvate six acid so we have one mole of sulfur present so we are going to have it reacted with 32 32 plus then we have four atoms of oxygen present in tetraoxo six and that is four multiplied by 16 or multiplied by 16 then this gives we are going to have 2 plus 32 plus 48 plus okay, we have 4 multiplied by 16 you're going to have 64 so it's close to 98 gram per mole it's close to 98 gram per mole that is the molar mass of hydrogen tetraoxosolvate 6 acid then we still want to calculate the number of mole number of mole so number then from the question we are having one mole from the question we have one mole of oxygen gas one mole of oxygen gas gives two moles gives two moles of h2so4 give two moles of x from the equation we are going we have a one mole of one mole of oxygen here gives two mole of hydrogen tetraoxo solvate six acid so we are going to have 1.5 moles 1.5 moles of oxygen gas gives 1.5 multiplied by Two moles multiplied by two multiplied by two that is moles of hydrogen solvate H2SO4. Then the answer is three moles. So we are going to have three moles here. Three moles that is 1.5 mole of oxygen gas. We give three moles of hydrogen tetraoxo solvate six acid. So our number of mole here is also three mole. Then from the 
formula above we have a mass mass is equals to number of moles number of moles multiplied by molar mass then we have calculated the number of moles to be three then we have also calculated the num the molar mass to be 98 gram per mole then we are going to have everything to be in gram so we have 98 gram per mole so is equals to when you multiply 3 mul by 8 when you multiply 3 by 8 you are going to have 294 gram that is don't forget that the unit is in gram then we come about this by having 3 moles 3 moles multiplied by 98 gram per mole then mole we cancel mole leaving only gram so it means our answer is 294 294 gram so that is the mass of hydrogen tetrauso so the six acid produced so we have just answered our 2017 chemistry theory for more videos click like and subscribe so still visit our website www.educateafrican.com for more videos related to YX 2017 chemistry theory and other YX chemistry theory and solutions. Thank you. God bless you.